it's the rendition of Porsche's refreshed for 2017, and recently turbo, passage level games auto with a settled rooftop, a 350 horsepower motor, and a 6 speed manual transmission. Alongside its 718 box to convertible kin, the 718 Cayman Roadster offers one of the purest driving encounters accessible in any game's auto, including inside Porsche's own stable. As a major aspect of an expansive retry, the 17 Cayman S got faster directing from the 911 Turbo, firmer suspension tuning, greater brakes from the 911 Carrera, and new sheet metal about all over, and additionally a turbocharged 2.5-liter level 4 setup of the earlier autos normally suction 3.4-liter level 6. Yield expanded by 25 drive and 37 pounds to foot of torque, the last accessible, conveniently, nearly 2,600 revolutions per minute bring down on the tachometer. The drive crest is lower, as well, by 900 revolutions per minute, however the most extreme motor speed drop by 300 revolutions per minute, to 7,500. The Sapphire Blue Cayman S we drove for this survey began at $67,350 before generally $15,000 in choices. Why we tested it and how it performed, we've officially tried the most recent manual and programmed non-S Caymans and additionally the programmed prepared S, and the circle requested combination. Given the dispatch control capacity and exceptionally quick moves of Porsche's double grasp PDK transmission, it's maybe nothing unexpected that the fastest Caymans are the automatics, with the base rendition requiring 3.9 seconds to get to 60 miles per hour and the S only 3.6. The manual prepared desk drive here gets to 60 miles per hour 0.2 seconds speedier than the 300 horsepower, stick move base auto, 4.1 versus 4.3. Along these lines, definitely, none of these autos are moderate. There additionally every one of the persistent handlers, a quality best appreciated by your adrenal organs however measured in our information by skid pad exhibitions that fall in the vicinity of 1.00 and 1.04 grams, with this S manual being the stickiest. Braking separations from 70 miles per hour are retina extending, as well, falling in the vicinity of 141 and 146 feet, this has halted in 145. We've likewise run three of the parcel on our 75 mile per hour roadway mileage circle, and it turns out the Cayman is moderately effective in such circumstances, this S manual accomplished 29 miles per gallon. Not excessively pitiful but rather a number that few on our staff, aside from the poor soul who traveled for quite a long time, will involvement in a Cayman, whatever remains of us were excessively bustling canning the thing inside an inch of its life, as the 19 miles per gallon we arrived at the midpoint of generally speaking will verify. What we like, well, we like practically everything about the Cayman S and its kin. There's a reason they've progressed toward becoming pillars of our 10 best cars brands. The suspension asks to be filled a corner, there's superb mid-motor adjust and correspondence at the point of confinement, and the ride is reasonable in practically every circumstance. In addition, with 15 cubic feet of freight space split between the front trunk and the hatchback zone, the Cayman is more qualified than most games autos for both everyday driving and long street trips. However, overlook drives or movement drudges, this is an auto that is tied in with living at the time. The agreeable feel of the essential controls encourages a relatively otherworldly association between the auto and its driver, and with turbocharged to work accessible everywhere throughout the time, the Cayman S basically pulls ass. The controlling, shifter, and grasp are almost impeccable regarding physicality, reaction, and weight, they're generous and responsive however not erroneously substantial or jumpy, not at all like a numerous other energetic autos where advertisers apparently manage the vibe. In case you will pound on this auto on byways or on a course, it's difficult to contend against our test auto's PASM Sport suspension, $2,070, with its lower ride stature, or the $1,320 Porsche to work vectoring, which groups singular back wheel braking and high mechanical constraint slip differential to give the Cayman a much more keen hunger for corner summits.
what we don't like, this auto overflows with all the dynamism one anticipates from a Porsche, however it's hard not to consider sparing $13,000-ish and getting the base Cayman with the manual. That model's execution numbers aren't that distant those of the S, and it offers the vast majority of similar choices outside of a couple of higher execution treats, for example, the PASM Sport framework. While we comprehend there's loads of benefit in Porsches individually alternatives show in a considerable measure a buyer request to requesting a particular auto, things like forming, $530, and ventilation, $730. For the seats, route, $1,730, auto diminishing mirrors, $690, and control situate change, $800 for two-way sport seats plus, which were all among the additional items fitted to our auto, should be incorporated on anything that begins north of $65,000. At long last, the progress to constrained enlistment has seen the motor sound turn out to be not so much euphoric but rather more a wreck. The 718 Cayman S still sounds incredible on the low end, where the mechanical decency of the level motor design radiates through, however at higher RPM there's more moaning and whooshing than in more established Caymans. That is with the $2,540 Sport Fumes, the auto is even less orally fulfilling without it. Decision, the Cayman is one of the best autos around, regardless of its setup.